Because let's face it, right? When you're looking at buying tickets to a game, are you going to like be like, yo, I want to buy tickets when the Raiders play the Chiefs or when the Raiders play the Panthers? I'm thinking, man, I want to watch the, the Raiders play the Panthers because I don't want to go pay a bunch of money just to get a, a big L, right, and walk out of there feeling all awful. It's like, I want to be able to watch my team win. Well, everybody that bought tickets for the Panthers game, that's not what they got, right? But traveling fans look at Vegas and they go, dang, the Raiders, two and four. Yeah, I had to buy tickets to that game. That way I could see potentially my team win. And then they go on vacation, they go gamble, all that stuff, man. Garbage, man. You know, and so like bringing in Tom Brady has the potential to where he's kind of doing some business decisions with Mark Davis. Because Mark Davis, he's going to do all the business stuff, right? And then Tom Brady, if he's playing a role in some of the football decisions, then Tom Brady is really well connected in the NFL. He had a very long, great career. He has more rings than any individual team has. That's insane, right? And so, like, really, uh, Tom Brady could potentially put us in a p- position where we're making good football decisions on top of business decisions. And if we start making good football decisions, then all of a sudden, all of a sudden we might actually start building a winning culture here in Vegas, man. Yes. And but striker, we hate Tom Brady, man. I'm telling you, man. All right. So a lot of you guys know I I'm in, I'm a person in long-term recovery, right? And there's a, a, a step that we work, man, where uh, we, we write down resentments, right? And when I when I first, first did this, the tuck rule was on my resentment list, right? And I had been holding on to that for years, right? Like, that is, like, one thing that, like, stuck with me. It's one of my early, like, I was, like, 14 when that happened, man. And that stuck with me into an adulthood, man. Still resentful. You guys ever see that video of Tom Brady and Charles Woodson talking about it? If you haven't, look up, look, look that video up.